Hey everybody, welcome back to the Metal Gear Recollection. We are going on to the third fucking Peace Walker battle because we haven't fought this fucking thing enough. Well, which Metal Gear are we playing? This, oh. This is Peace oh. Walker. This is episode 16 of Peace Walker. I'm having a bad time. Yeah, I hate everything. Shut up. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm bringing, I'm bringing a big fat fucking machine gun. Yeah, bring your, bring your best one. I'm bringing my PKM. It's my best one. Your well, best one. 200 rounds in the belt clip thing. I Magazine. Got, I got clips in my gun because Fuck. it's a gun and clips. On clips. Merv reentry. How can you? How can you even say that with a straight face? Cause fuck your mouth. <laughs> Did that answer your question? No. Okay, I forget what I need to do. I think I just need to fucking shoot at this thing for like an hour. Like I, under, uh, I think it's underneath the bulb. It's underneath the. What is? That thing right there. That? Yeah. Oh. No. no, no. Where is it? What am I supposed no, to The pod, I think. You're supposed to use to shoot the pod. You mean that pod? That pod that's up in the air there? Mm, no, no, no. The reptile pod. I think that is the reptile pod, because that's the ass end of it. Remember, the mammal, the mammal pod was that one. The what? Wait, hold I on. think. No, the mammal pod was on the ass. That the reptile one? pod. That's the mammal pod. That's the mammal pod. That's the reptile pod. Why does the mammal pod have a vagina? Look at it bleeding oil. Fucking leaking! She's so wet. Fuck this. Yeah, this is actually... Yeah. Yeah, I can deal with this. <laughs> I can fucking deal with this. Get my frustration out. Just Do rip it. that shit to shreds. Do it. Yeah. Ammunition. On a mission. Suck my... Shut up. Oh, 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 oh. So this thing's just straight up exploding. I don't really get... Like now I'm shooting at all the potteries. Now just shoot at the fucking uh, reptile pod. Reloading. Reptile pod. Reptile. You're positive you this doing? is it? Yeah. Okay. You're positive, B. Just fucking keep shooting it. Okay. Welcome to the next 45 minutes of this fucking LP. Tony telling me to just keep doing it. Eventually, he'll feel something. Do oh, it! Oh. You see what I did there? No, I forget. I didn't, didn't really do much of anything at all. What? So, for those of you, for those of you who don't remember what happened last time, we had a hell of a legitimate boss fight against this thing, and now we're just fucking firing at it. Try shooting the door. Oh shit! The fuck? The the rocket launcher fell off in front of me. Look at this thing trying so fucking hard to blow shit up. And it looks like it's got a dumb half-open mouth. It fires it anyways. It fires it right at Snake, and Snake deflects it with his high-frequency <laughs> blade. <laughs> Rules of nature! Oh, God. <laughs> so it's still attempting to fire the fucking nuke. Look at this thing. I wish Snake's face would do anything other than be a, a solid model. Yeah, before just be something other than this stoic fucking asshole that he is. Yeah. Okay, so there's... Oh, God! The mammal pod's waking back up. The boss is still there. There's a, li there's a literal ghost in the machine shit happening right now. Deus Ex Machina! Deus Ex Machine Gun. Look at this. Black, 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 so this black, part black. is actually very important. The boss is taking this shit back over despite being horribly brain damaged and all kinds of fucked up. Look at this. Shit. I did more da I did more damage in three minutes with a machine gun than I did in a half an hour with over a hundred rockets. Yep. Fucking son of a bitch ass. Donkey fuck. I love them a hot bucket. I'm super salty about that boss fight, dude. That shit. That shit's annoying doing it on your own. Not even when you're doing it for a goddamn LP. Mm. That shit's just annoying in general. It is not fun. It is long and the payoff 
payoff is not very big. Also, look at this fucking loading screen. Look at this. Peace is happening. Peace. Actually, this is the the first finale of this game right here. Mm. Finaru cut Sinaru. Mm. And then shit happens. This is kind of a weird thing that Kojima started doing with uh, his games. Is after Peace, or Peace Walker onwards, <laughs> all the games, like, you would beat the story, and then there was still story. So you would get to the actual climactic finale, and yeah. then from there, it's like, well, shit, it just keeps going. I think he really wanted to do that with 4, because I get that feeling. Did he? What? No. What? No, 4 is the most this is the end of any fucking thing I've ever seen. Uh, are you sure? Yeah. Also, the boss is singing to us. It's a very pretty singing voice. She picked it up. She picked it up in World War II. Apparently. Oh, look, they even mentioned Deus the ghost the machine. Machina. Just, like, straight up. The boss has taken over this thing, and it's walking into the lake oh, where it said that, yeah, she's it'll, drowning. it'll, she, yeah. She's drowning herself. <laughs> look, huh. You think everybody'd be happy. Yeah. You think everybody'd be happy? Interesting. Damaged, some someone somewhere. Is... No, it's huh? not someone somewhere. It's the boss is doing this. Technically. No, no, no. Someone somewhere is still gonna be angry. Oh yeah. In fact, you're gonna see. You're gonna see here that even Snake is like, wait, what? His confuser did it. It's actually how he reacts to this uh, begins to define him as a character for the rest of this series. <clears throat> oh, look at all the little series. peace things popping up. Peace! The boss wants peace. The boss wants a world as one as she saw from space. Is this her answer? No she borders. Cries. Probably. Song. It's clearly not thinking rationally. Oh, God. This is, I mean, if it wasn't for the shitty boss fight souring the flavor of this moment, this is a very interesting moment. Because the boss was all about war. Yeah. Even if she said she was fighting for peace, the boss was all about fucking war. Well, she was the joy, so she took joy into the battlefield. Yes. Do you hear joy. Well, you never saw her in any of that. No, you didn't. I really wish they'd make a game about that. No, they can't. They would fuck it up. And now, without Kojima, they would fuck it up even harder. Yep. Oh my God, would they fuck that up? It would become it would become the original Call of Duty. Yep. There you go. There. That's how you do it. You just say, "Hey, look, this is Metal Gear Solid Zero: The Boss Chronicles," and then just play a Call of Duty game. <laughs> So this, those words specifically right there are extremely important. The boss is putting down her gun and instead singing of peace. They can all hear you. I know they can. Why is that important, Tony? Tell me. It's peace Walker. It is. Oh. <laughs> yes. That's, that's kind of funny. Or that's kind of, yeah. But that's a betrayal of everything that the boss is. And Snake knows that. It's not really the boss, then. Is it? Snake Snake takes it as it being the boss. Now he's saluting her, but he's hesitating. Throws off the bandana. Aw, oh, she's so sad. Hmm. Maybe she's going to go bang a, a dude in a wheelchair. Did he, uh, what? Yeah. Did he throw away the bandana that he took from the boss? Yes. Is that the same bandana? Yes. Huh. But it keeps appearing throughout the rest of the game. Or throughout the rest of the series, I should say. No. Yeah. Like, I'm pretty sure it's canon up until uh, the 90s, which I'll just say the 90s. I won't go further than that. But up until the 90s, every game has the same bandana. Hmm. All standing Except up. Ground Zeroes. I don't think he had a bandana in that one. Uh, no, but that's only because that game's 45 minutes long. Oh. Game! Like, that'll be, that'll be a two-parter for sure. 
Okay. That'll be the mission, and then I'll show the fun mission where we do the thing to get a specific person for another thing. Oh, I know who. I know who. Yeah. Yes. What took you so long? Or that was perfect, depending on whether or not you S-rank it. Yeah. But hey, so that was Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. At least that was that was the first 70% of it. Where's the last 30? Uh, we're going to see 5% of the last 30, because the last 30 of it is just side shit. The last 30 of it is uh, just oh, yeah. like handheld stuff. Because I got to the end of this game, and I've only unlocked about 30% of the items. Actually, probably less. Yep. So you get you get your main missions that you can play at Infinium, and you get your side missions that you can play at Infinium. But you only mm -hmm. get, like, 30 of the 100 or so side missions that are in this game. You get the vast bulk of them after you beat the the story mode and that leads you on to the rest of the story is by playing through those because things happen as the story mode or as you play the side ops ashley woodyard sucks oh come on it was fine <laughs> it was fine anyways good artista -roo. anyways but yeah so a lot of like doing the side ops and doing all these extra missions and doing it all stealthy as big boss is it's really part of the lore of these games because later on once you get into later decades so much of the games revolve around um so many of the games revolve around the idea of of this legend that is big boss right he is a legend on the battlefield he is he is the closest thing. He, well, I can't say that. He's basically the god of this world. I can't say that. Fucking. You try. You get what I'm trying to say, right? Slightly. If you put it in the better words, I'd probably get it. So much of these games and the story that's in these games and and the people that you meet in these games are affected by this man. Mm. That the next 50 years, this guy and the shit that he did affected so many people that it's just constantly running through it. It's basically, if there's if there's a battle in the world, and that's part of this guy's mythos, is later on you get basically to the point where if if there's a battle going on in the, plant, in the world fucking anywhere, he was there, or he was doing some shit with it, or he had something to do with it. Right. So okay. he's, he's a fucking legend. So the fact that a lot of these games you have to do like side op stuff. Um, really, what's the word I'm looking for? Since a lot of these games you have to do a bunch of side missions and stuff. And you have to do extra missions mm -hmm. in order to um, get to the true ending of the game. Is kind of... Is, is, is kind of kind of plays into that and that legend is that look at all this military shit this guy's been doing <laughs> it's nuts man it's nuts it's freaking nuts Troy Baker did you see Obviously it? Cause, yeah. Troy Baker always ends up being the voice of like the generic enemies in these games <clears throat> you sure? cause he was pretty good in The Last of Us yeah it was Troy, Troy Baker was Ocelot in Phantom Pain. Right? You sure? Yeah. No, I thought he was Kaz. <laughs> Kazahara Miller. Miller. Oh, that's the other guy. Miller that's the other is, guy. No, Miller has always been Robert Atkin Downs. Yeah, Robert Atkin. Mm. Drink mm. your disgusting shit. Mmm. <laughs> 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 I just chugged two pints of water. Good job. Fucking shit my ass. <laughs> Tony. <sighs> I want to let you know I'm very happy. Because uh, it's over? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's over. It's, it's technically over. This is like the third part of the first finale of this game. In terms of, like... Fucking, what's the word I'm looking for? In terms of, like, the episodes. Mm -hmm. And since at this point they're getting released weekly, which... The, don't hold me to that if you're listening to this and they're not being released weekly anymore. Uh, I warned you. 
But basically, people have been watching this sh this finale Schlepp. for three weeks up to this point. Technically, Ooh. four weeks. And then there's a f there's a legitimate finale after this that sets up the rest of the games. Hmm. Uh, so I guess we can talk about that now. And I know I've mentioned it before, but yes, there are a lot of side ops you need to do in order to get the true finale, the true end of this game. You will not see the vast majority of it. Uh, what I plan on doing for the last episode of this, which will be the next episode, is I plan on... Hey, Vocaloid! Look, it's a Vocaloid! Vocaloid, Did Vocaloid, you see Vocaloid! It? it said Vocaloid. Yeah. Tony likes Vocaloids. He likes rubbing them on his cock! Yep. Um, but anyways, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do all the grindy shit that you need to do off camera and set it up so that I have to do one thing in order to trigger the end of the game. Um, and then for the episode, I'll show like one or two things off. Um, yeah, I'll show like one or two things off and then uh, do the finale and that should take about a normal episode's amount of time in order to do. Like so then, 30 minutes? Yeah. Yeah. That's about there, 25 to 30 minutes, somewhere in there. So that will be that will be the legitimate ending of this game, and at that point we will be moving on to Ground Zeroes and Phantom Pain, which I cannot wait for. I cannot wait to play those games because those games feel hot. They feel like good sex hotness. Hmm. Yeah, they're amazing. They are such amazing games. Like, just from a gameplay standpoint, I will sing the praises of those games for fucking ever. Mm. Those two sure? are perfect. Yeah, and it, it fucking kills me that Kojima's gone and the Fox engine that he created that game in is going to be only used for, like, fucking soccer now. What if he makes another engine? Uh, well, if he makes another engine, it's not going to be anywhere near the same because the guy that made the Fox engine went to go work for another company. Mm. I can't remember who picked him up. I can't remember if it was Capcom or EA or fucking... But remember, he's an independent now. He is an independent. And have you seen the logo for his new company? Nah. It's a fucking sick, super metal, mecha-ass looking suit of armor. Nice. It's fucking awesome. Look it up. Look up just like Google Kana or, uh, Kojima new company logo. <coughs> you, you fucking weeb, you'll poop your pants. Also, whoops. Well, fuck the, yourself. The screen went all dack. Uh, that's not the one I'm looking for. What do you mean? It just shows... Oh, okay, there we go. I see it now. Yeah, that does look fucking cool. Isn't that fucking metal as fuck? So clearly like he a... took Shinkawa with him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fuck Konami. Seriously, <laughs> fuck Capcom. Oh, because they did... Uh, and Ubisoft. That's right, because they did a bunch of uh, crossovers in the previous mm. versions of this game. So there's actual Monster Hunter missions where you fight like fucking Rathaloses and shit. Nice. And I can't How the fuck do you know about Monster Hunter? How do you not know about Monster Hunter? You never play Monster Hunter! I know everything about Monster Hunter. No, you don't. Yes. I do. I'm the one who plays it. I know everything about Monster I Hunter. I have never seen you play a game. Also, you don't you play mention. fucking Monster Hunter. You don't have a goddamn Wii U. You don't got 3DS, bitch. Uh, yes, I do. No. Yes, I do. Go no. fuck yourself. You have a Wii U? Yeah. Bro. I just don't like playing it. But, dude, pick up Bayo 2. No! Really? Well, uh, pick up really... Bayo 2 and Wonderful 101. They're two platinum games, but they're also two of the very best games on that console. No shit, because they made my platinum. Yeah. And I have a fucking huge crush on Bayo. Wonderful 101 is absolutely amazing, too. Yeah, pick up Bayo, dude. It comes with the original Bayonetta running better than it did ever before on the but same. They're, they're releasing it as a standalone. You know that, right? Yeah, you don't want it as a standalone. Just get the thing. It might be better. No. Well, why both? Support Platinum. Yeah. Fucking support... Fucking support Platinum. That's crazy, because it's got, like, circles and shit, and there's a skull inside the fucking mecha. Yeah. That's awesome. Isn't that awesome? Snake. It's fucking crazy. What's there. also awesome is here. Here's where here's where Snake reacts to the boss. I'm not going he is in shock. L mm -hmm. Listen to him. He's not going back. He's in fucking yeah. shock. He's done. He's I'm pissed done. off. I'm done looking for the truth. He's done looking, looking for the for truth. The truth. What are you saying, uh huh. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. Come on, boss. Come on, boss. Everybody's waiting for you. The wrong voice. 
She betrayed me, Kaz. So he, voice again. He, he, <laughs> in the end, she put down her gun. That's the most important part you want to take away from this. Is basically she rejected her entire life. Oh, well, I mean, I'm just saying what he's fucking saying. What do you mean? <laughs> in giving up her life, she abandoned everything. She wow. abandoned her mission, is what he's you saying. Say that and that that to him is a betrayal. Because he was so, or she was so loyal to her mission. She was so loyal to her mission that she allowed herself to be killed for her mission. Now on, twice. And now he's like, now call me fucking big boss. Now I'm big boss. I am who I am, and I'm gonna fuck up shit. Yeah. Shit's gonna get shitted up. Shit, dick, shit. Da 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 da. So peace has died with the boss. Not really, but, you know. Yeah. Hey, I've unlocked a tuxedo. Nice. And a bunch of co-op shit. And I'm going to get a bunch of heroism and a bunch of blah, blah, blah for beating the end of the game. And then you go on to being able to do the rest of the stuff. What's up? It's about boss. You know she doesn't so this is also, this is another, hey, we're adopting more child soldiers. Yeah. <laughs> Like seriously. Oh, so they're like, what do we do? What do we do about this little sixteen year old girl? I put her to work in the kitchen. No, seriously. What about letting her stay here for a while? You actually, have, you actually ever see her again besides ground zeros and V? Shut up. Right now no one understands. The two part episode that's gonna be ground zero. No. No. <coughs> shut up. Fuck you. Seriously, shut up. Fuck you! It's important no that, you, Fuck her, that you. you stop speaking. No. You should talk to her In fact, I may bleep you out. And, uh, you son of a bitch ass motherfucking ass cunt. So now they're saying, look, we're picking up women. <laughs> My oil tanker is so awesome, I get to pick up chicks. <laughs> Are you gonna start fucking now? Uh. No? No? No, but now we have Strange Love, who we're gonna put in R and D, and we also have Paz working at the base too. Paz, Paz and Strange Love. He looks like a boy. And now we can develop more things, and people are getting better, and combat operations, and there's things happening, and everybody's happy. Woo! Yay. So let's take a look at these motherfuckers. These so Strange Love. Strange Love's pretty good in the kitchen too. Oh. I'm not putting her in the fucking kitchen, though. It's better than fucking not. Look at Paz. She's good at... Here, let's take a intel. look. She's good at intel and I'm cooking kitchen. So... What the fuck, Kojima? <laughs> da -da -da -da. <laughs> She's not actually Costa Rican, though. She's 16. Legal 16. in Texas. Legal in Texas. <laughs> No, let's go in Alabama. Okay, let's put her on the intel team. Fuck it, why not? And actually, we can take Miller off of the food team and put him back on the intel, intel? team too. Yeah. 139% of food. Yep, which is great. Now we've got a great ass, ass, intel, ass team. Modifaka. Also, look, we also have Dezor Dezornov. Fuck me, fuck my life. We also Dezornov. have Zadornov in the... Uh, the, in in custody, next to cod, next to cod piece. Ha 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 ha. Cod piece. And for some reason, Amanda is still sick. Amanda stays at your fucking base the entire game, but you can never really use her because she's sick, and she never becomes not sick. I'm sick of it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I gotta fix the roster limit. Whoops, I'm being a fucking idiot here. How just do you fix the roster limit? Wasting everybody's time. You just take everybody off the teams. Oh. Okay, so. Those people <laughs> I took <laughs> off, and then you discharge them. Fire! Right into Fire. your urethra. Okay, so. Get fired! I also wanted to show off. Look. We have Zeke. Yes. It's not 100% complete because it's still nope. missing the Ray Dome and the AI, AI pod that goes on top. Uh, yes. But that's part of the shit that you grind out is the ability to put the the, 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 
the thing on there and then do the you stuff. And it's important. It's also important for for this playthrough that we make it the proper color. We make it the proper color. Purple. Purple. There we go. <laughs> Oni chan so kawaii. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck your fucking mother. Fuck you. And since we technically have a little time, let's do one side. A off little here. time? Fuck you! I ain't got no time. I gotta go do fuck shit. You don't have to fuck no shit. Should we do an armored vehicle battle, or should we go on a date with Pops? Date with Pops. Nope. No. Nope. I didn't think that was an actual thing. That's for the finale. We're going on a date with Pops, and we're gonna feel her up real good. Oh. Oh my, my God. God. I'm so sorry. Here, Fulton Recovery. Let's get this mission started. Wow. Complete the mission. Wow. And fucking shut. Fuck. Sh I am stunned. What did you do in Illinois? Fuck your shut. Shut your fuck. Fucking tits. <laughs> Alright, so we've got our nice silence, then we've got our twin barrel, because as you were able to see in one of those episodes, that shit is Use that shield. Like. Use the shield! I will use fuck. the shield in one of the missions in the finale episode. Shit. I will do that. Fuck on my dick. So, just to show you all the shit that Snake's doing, he's looking at men. Look at him looking at men. He's here for the men. He's here for the men. Popping. Popping faces. So that's funny that you shoot them and their fucking heads come off or their helmets come off. And then they're just like, oh, I, I don't know. I don't understand what's going on here. So oh, I'm supposed to grab to... me a big sexy hostage you. It's cool. Don't try to take cover or anything. I believe it's helmet just came off. Who me? No, these guys. Yeah, they're just like, oh, my helmet came off. I wonder why it did that. Why the fuck isn't buckled around your chin, you fuck? Cut. Seriously, that's a good question. <laughs> that shit's real important, Cho. Bye bye. So, yeah, the next time you guys see, like, obviously I'm fucking around here, but the next time you guys see um, us, we will have unlocked all the stuff, or the vast majority of the stuff, because I'm not going to get, I'm not going to get the, the stuff up to, like, level 90 or whatever the fuck. Fuck that shit. Yeah, seriously. Seriously. <laughs> but I will get it to the point where the last boss fight isn't necessarily trivial, but it's going to be... Good, Easy. it's gonna be fine. I shot him in the butt and he just went down. Does that work? It's a meaty area. Where do they give your penis? Oh, I shot him in the butt and he just went down. Oh, that's great. Now, butt stuff. Now I know to go for butt stuff. Hardcore, <laughs> greasy butt stuff. A man's ass. A man's butt. Subject confirmed on board helicopter. Uh, is he here? No, he's not. I believe it's an old wooden ship. He could be. What? What the fuck are you talking about? Old wooden. Nothing. Ship? Shoot him in the ass. <laughs> fuck you. Oh my god. Oh, he work. was fine with. That. How about his dick? Oh. Girl. Right in the dick. Girl. Dick. We are fucking. We are children. Maybe. We are goddamn children. What the fuck's it matter? Actually, I think it's in the next area here. I don't think it's like. Right around here. Oh, but there is a confidential document. Aerial oh, mine. Yes. Amazing. There it is. If only there I it had is. that for the chrysalis fight. There it is! There it is! Jesus Christ. <laughs> you sound like a different person. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is turning into a long one. Yes, it is. That's Where what she said. Up? Ha! Ah! Ha! I like your ass, Morgan. You're lying, Morgan. Oh, I fucking love that one. That's pretty. Like, fuck shit. Oh, oh fuck shit. Shit. Oh, fuck, ass. Fuck, fuck, a man's piss, butt. Piss, 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 fuck. Piss. Piss. Piss and ass. 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 Piss. Oh! 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 He's a man. Can I get him? 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 Boom. Oh shit! He went down. Oh, you missed. Oh, he went down. Oh, he went down. There we go. It's okay. Everything's okay. Watch me use all the Fultons and not be able to get my man. That would suck. Not be able to get my man. Comma off. Oh, there he is. Ah! Oh, mine! There was a mine and I... Fuck. Did... You fucked! Mine. Mine. 
Fuck. I got jacked up. There's now men looking for me. What's the way to get out of here? Oh, I gotta go back in the other direction. Oh, shitty! Oh, shitty! Oh, he's coming! Oh, shitty wall! Oh, no, I had to be up there! Oh, God, Jesus! They're going into alert Did he drop something? What is that? What is that? Bullets. He dropped... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah! My Fulton is super good, so now my Fulton, the guys drop things when the Fulton comes out of them. What? Hey, look, there, we did a side mission. Hey, you Fulton yourself. Yeah. Nice! You can kind of do that in Phantom Pain. You have to, nice! You have to Fulton a cargo crate and be on top of the cargo crate. You get Fulton. Oh, that's stupid. And then Dee Dee and Ocelot swap models. <laughs> All right, that's enough fucking bullshit for now. Hey, thanks See for sparing with us, later. guys. Join us next time for the finale, the dramatic conclusion of P.A.C. No, Wireke. Don't do it. Thank you. No, please do it. Don't. Okay, look. So now Metal Gear Zeke is actually complete. So we're actually going to continue. So shut up. It's still going. I can activate it any time. So I will show that really quickly. Very quickly, we're going to send it out to blow up some dudes. And by quickly, you mean like 10 minutes. We're going to send it out to blow up some fucking dudes. Take it out for a field test. Fucking put it all up in the shit, man. Just fucking just... Yeah, ow, I just... I smack my fingers into my controller. It hurts. You stupid fuck! Ow! Ow! It hurts a lot. My double adjusting the AI. Tits! Uh, uh, strange as well. Can I get a work? Hey yo, hey yo! Tits! It looks like she has a double chin there. That's not very sexy. <laughs> Lose very some flattery. weight, you fucking cow! Land whale. Okay. What? So, we'll talk about it more in the next episode. No, we won't. But basically, she's saying, look, we can put a nuke on Z. No. And I don't know, I don't know if we will be able to get to the point, but the decision is made to, like, if we see it, but the decision is made to put a nuke on Zeke. Hopefully you don't actually go through with it. Which means that, what, by this point in time, they're the fourth or fifth nuclear power in the world? I wouldn't expect you to. This, this fucking PMC Corp. This PMC that's literally at the throat, like sitting right in America's back door, has got itself a goddamn nuclear weapon. We've got nukes, yo. Send us money. It actually becomes a huge, huge fucking problem. Oh, yeah? Okay, where was I going with this? Okay, yeah, Zeke, really quick. Zeke. We're going to Go. dispatch Zikaru. Anybody die? Nope, nobody died. All right, what's a good one? What's an S plus mission? Do we want to eliminate the armored unit or eliminate? Uh, we'll defend, armored unit. We will defend the key base and we will defend armored. the key base with, with fucking Zeke. Metal Gear Zeke, which it shows you the stupid little AI pod that we have for it. Let's throw some more vehicles on here. Let's throw a bunch. I have a lot of helicopters and tanks. Helichafters. Helichankers. All right, noise. Throw the KPZ seventy on here. Look at that. I'm gonna fuck shit up. Yeah, fuck the, it up real these good. These guys are gonna get fucked. Actually, let me get rid of the LAV too, and put more fucking tanks. Tanks. More predecessors to the M1 Abrams. <laughs> fucking. Wow. Fuck it. Screw Bongo and Jay. Which sounds like a Jay and Silent Bob fucking. Thing. Okay, so that is Launch. the maximum strength for a unit there, damn near. Shit's about to go nuts. Zeke! Okay, now thanks, and we'll see you fuckers next time. We all love you with holes. Don't do it. Do it.